All right, guys, welcome back to another episode of Muddy River Catfishing. Um, a while back, my my dad and I went fishing, and we're fishing next to these guys that uh, they're doing quite well. They're catching a bunch of fish, and uh, in this case, they were fishing for trout. And so we kind of peeked over there to see what they were using for bait. And much to our surprise, they were using the same bait we were. We were we were both using worms for bait. So my dad went over there and kind of talked to the, the older man. He had asked him, uh, is there any secret that you have there that we're using the same bait? Um, it looked like it was even bought from, from the same place. So the old man said, yeah, what I do is I put garlic into my worms and it's as simple as it sounds, but it seemed to have worked. And like I said, this was used on trout. I haven't used it for catfish yet, so I'm gonna do a segment on regular worms versus garlic worms. So I'm gonna show you guys how to make that, and we'll see what happens. So garlic worms are pretty much as easy as it sounds. I've got these. 18 Canadian night crawlers that I bought at Walmart. And I don't know if you guys have noticed, but before it used to be 24, then they went down to 20, and now they're down to 18. And I've noticed that as, as time's gone on, but oh well, what can you do, I guess, huh? Anyways, so there's your worms. And all I've got here is a clove of garlic. I'm just gonna chop it up. Add it to the worms. That's it. I'll take a marker and mark them. G for garlic worms. And that's really all there is to it. You can also add a little bit of garlic powder if you want, but don't use garlic salt. They, they don't like garlic salt. They don't like the salt. The salt is gonna really, really affect them. But this, this will mix into the dirt. They'll absorb it, they'll eat the, the garlic, and they'll put out that scent of garlic when they're in the water. So, there's just another idea for you guys. Give it a try. Um, let me know how it works for you. And like I said, keep an eye out for a video of regular night crawlers versus garlic night crawlers. And until next time, take care. We'll see you out on the water.